hello everyone and welcome to my channel today we're talking about march favorites so if you're interested in seeing what i've been enjoying in the month of march stay tuned but don't forget to hit that subscribe button let's get started all right so we're going to talk about some things that are non-beauty related now uh, we're going to talk about two tv shows that i've been really enjoying um one is called 911 and the other one's called 911 Lone Star. Yes, Lone Star. Um, the first one, uh, 911, includes uh, Angela Bassett. And then the second one is with, the Lone Star one is with Rob Lowe. Now, if you're interested in shows that will kind of just keep you like with a lot of suspense and a lot of drama and intensity, that show would definitely give it to you. Um, I love, one thing that I love about that show is that there's always different stories and different scenarios and um, problems that the firefighters have to solve. And the things that you see are just like unbelievable. Like the last episode I seen, um, this guy's eyes were like, was like basically popping out. It was, it was insane. I screamed when I saw it. So um, if you're interested in TV shows like that, definitely check it out. All right. So let's talk snacks. You know, I love snacks. So I got this from Target. It's called Garden Lights Veggie Veggies Made Great. It's a double chocolate muffin made with fresh zucchini, zucchini and carrots. Now this is so good, especially with coffee. Um, 110 calories, gluten free. If you have a sweet tooth and you're not trying to go like all crazy, definitely check this out. Um, yeah, I really do enjoy it. Now, if you're going to eat this, I will take it out a couple hours so it could defrost um, because it comes frozen. See here? But so good. Really good. Now, let's talk makeup. So, I have really been loving Born This Way Foundation. I used to wear this years ago. And when I worked at Sephora and I used to get compliments on this foundation when I wore it. Um, but it is in the color sand and yeah, I forgot how much I really like this foundation. It's medium coverage is, it gives you like that radiant look, but it is buildable. So I definitely recommend this foundation. I know a lot of people enjoy it, but when you stop using it and you start using it again, you realize, wow, that's a good foundation. So I'm glad I start using it again. Let's talk about this expensive Gucci mascara that I have been enjoying. Um, now, I'm not telling you to run out and buy it. No, I'm not. But I really have been enjoying it because it does such a good job of separating my lashes and it does not make my lashes look clumpy. So, yeah, definitely a favorite. All right, let's talk NARS. Now, I forgot I had this palette, the Bord de Plague, and I decided to like bust it out. And this palette is so good. The highlighters are great. They're just amazing. Let's show you here. If I could do it this way. Here it is a little dirty. Don't mind that. I'll give you some swatches. The bronzers are nice too, but the highlighters are just amazing. All right. See if I could do it. Look at that formula is kind of like really creamy, not too powdery, um, just really smooth. If you can see here, unfortunately, it's not available anymore. But hopefully, maybe one day they'll bring it back. Really beautiful. Last two products, lips. So, Jeffree Star. I love his formula. Now I have two colors. They're perfect everyday colors. We have androgyny and then we have celebrity skin. I find that I gravitate to celebrity skin pretty often because I think you could just, you could use this with any eye look. So let me swatch this for you here. I have it on today, but I, I, can, I use a lip gloss on top of it as well. But yeah, that is celebrity skin. And then Androgyny. I'm pretty sure I'm going to have to re repurchase these two. I know I will. Look, really pretty. 
Yeah, his, I love his formula. Like, I, I do have... I used to buy a lot of his liquid lipsticks and I had to slow down because I was not going to use all those colors. Like, I had all the, these funky colors, but... I'm like, let me just get through the products that I have before I purchase any more. But yeah, I do love this formula. All right, and that concludes my March favorites. Before you go, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, like, and comment, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.